Hello. It's Nate Eisenberg here and hello, how are you doing? Um this is a little video for Madman Bobo and anyone that doesn't understand what Random Arca is. So basically how I can describe it is Um it's really hard to explain. It's an app that basically You think of something you want to look for. And basically either you say to the app, I want to find a certain subject in the world around me. So basically in most of my videos you've seen, or well, my most recent one, um, a subscriber on the channel said look for this intent anxiety. Now what it does is basically the app takes what I say to it or think about and it searches via Google Maps to try and find a location that kind of coincides with what I asked it. So basically What the app does is it basically kind of so kind of sort of reads your subconscious mind as well, and also it's kind of to do with quantum physics as well. Basically, what that is is what I've, what I can understand from quantum physics is is very brainy. The the app does a thousand calculations or something. I'm not sure where it calculates where it could put your point. So basically, um, the intent, for example, the intent I did for Miss Croft, shout out to Miss Croft, keep on plugging away missus, you'll get back to where you were before. Um, she gave me the intent treasure. Now basically what the app tried to do is it went on Google Maps as soon as I clicked a button on the app and it tried to find something to do with treasure or something near enough to it. So basically it's a, it's like Pokemon Go but it's without the Pokemon. It's also an exploration app as well. So basically through the intents that all you lovely people who subscribe to my channel has given me over the past couple of videos, it's helped me kind of like explore the town that I'm living in the now and parts of it that I wouldn't normally go to and obviously I've met a couple of people also through using the app a saying to them about it, what it's all about um, and I also love the couple of people a, obviously people that live in the neighbourhood they Obviously it helped me properly understand where exactly I needed to go to get to my point. So basically, it's a conversation starter as well. So yeah, so hopefully Madman Bobble, that's cleared up most of it for you. But if it hasn't, then do feel free to say, obviously comment on this video and ask me more questions if you're still confused. But what you'll see in the comment, not in the comments, what you'll see uh, down in my description for this video is a link to all my other random Oka videos which I've called Scottish Navigation and in there you'll see the types of things that basically my other subscribers have helped me find basically they, they've given me intense like say like it's like a basic how can I explain it? How I explain it to people that see me out Randonautin is I basically say basically Randonautica is basically kind of like a weird creepy treasure hunt but it's not creepy well there are people in America that play Randonautica as well because it's worldwide but you can see half of that is staged and obviously I said in my latest video that my channel is not about sensationalizing things with my random article videos what you see is what you get 
So basically, if I was to search for something, it would take me to something near enough to do with the intent I say to the app, literally by talking to my phone, the microphone at the bottom of my phone, or thinking it. Um, so basically, I obviously jumped on it, on the app as soon as it was in the app store, because it's stuff like this, like the unknown, and stuff to do with the subconscious mind, and like, what the universe has planned for all of us. I kind of like, I'm into that kind of stuff, it's like, hmm. You know, like the mystery of the universe, the mystery of quantum physics, and the mystery of what is really going on with this app. One day, eventually, they will reveal what this app is and what it's doing and how it does everything. But if that day comes, I don't want to see and I don't want to learn how it all works because. It's kind of like, you know the, you know all the magicians, the celebrity magicians like Darren Brown, uh, David Blaine, uh, Paul and Teller. You don't want to ask them how they do their tricks and that, like their magic tricks and all that, because as soon as you know how they do them, it's not, it's not fun anymore. So that's how I basically see this up if they were to tell us exactly how they're doing everything and how they place things at locations and show you where they are on the map. If they were to tell you if they're doing that kind of stuff, which they've not confirmed, and I think that's a good thing because it's like a magic act. If they were to tell us how it, was, how it, was, how it works and how they do it, it wouldn't be fun anymore. So, I mean, as I said before, if the day comes and they release a video or they say this is how we did everything and this is what it's all about I wouldn't want to watch that video because then it would take the fun out of the app like I said I mean the fun of the app basically is not knowing how they do it that's what makes it fun um, so basically a madman bubble I don't want to repeat myself but the next video and the series will be me looking for your intent in Randonautica. And by the way, it was a fantastic intent, by the way. Basically, something you want me to search for. I think I'll say that from now on so people will know what I'm talking about. Um, but obviously, once my previous video, uh, Scottish Navigation number four, reaches about 10 likes, then I'll start recording a all the new intents that you lovely people have uh, suggested I look for. Um, how long have I actually spoken for? I have no idea. I'm going to try and take it to the 10 minute mark because YouTube kind of likes that. Um, although if I ever do come across anything that's like kind of really suspicious, I'll show it on camera, but I won't go anywhere near it because, like I says, I've had quite a few busts as well, which basically means you go to the point and there's nothing there. And basically, I kind of think that I put it into the, into the app, into the video or not. Say, for instance, I was to ask it, can you find me something to do with the colour purple. Now, what the app does is, if I'm right in thinking, it basically, like I say, is it obviously uses Google Maps to try and find something that coincides with the intent purple. Now, obviously, Madman Bobo, the legend that he is, he didn't understand, but hopefully this little video explains it, and hopefully he understands when he watches this. And all these that are here watching this video also will understand, hopefully, after this explanation of what the app is, that you'll under, hopefully understand. So, basically, it works by 
your subconscious as well, I think. Now, with that, so hopefully that is a good enough explanation for everyone watching if they want to know how. Basically, an explanation of the app. Um, I do suggest checking out a couple of channels, i.e. Jazzgo, HDD Hunting the Dead, and CJ Facing. And what I'll do also is I shall put in the description box down below a link to the latest videos from those other YouTubers and hopefully that will help you guys understand more about the app. So guys, as ever, stay gold.